Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nog. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to play Castle of Glass by Saringer. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. Without further ado, let's jump into the description. I started creating a hammer map last summer, which is going to have 18 rooms, each having a separate puzzle, while all of them together making up a way bigger puzzle, and an easter egg that makes the puzzle twice as hard if you're trying to get it. 60 hours I'm in, I'm at like 40 to 50% done, but I didn't have any time lately because of my studies, so I'll get back to it next summer. In that puzzle, each individual room has its own name, and this map is the remake of two rooms I call Castle of Glass, together. It has some minor changes to make the puzzle playable standalone without the other rooms. Difficulty, 6 out of 10 normal. Moving with a cube while aiming at a receptacle is not part of the solution. I'll try and remember that. Have fun, the feedback is always welcome and appreciated. Without further ado, let's jump in and... Um, yeah, wow, 60 odd hours in and you're not even potentially halfway to a map that is going to be one beastly map if i do say so myself but um without further ado guys let's jump in shall we please continue into the next test chamber which involves deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers okay Where is square? Okay, that's toggleable. Let's toggle it off for now, shall we? Uh, we're gonna have to go up here. I don't see any other way of kind of proceeding over here right now. So exit requirement is I'm guessing. That'll be a flip panel. Oh, so that stops. So that turns that one off. Okay, good to know. All right, so let's toggle this again. I can actually go through here. Is there anything through here? Never thought to look through here. Okay. So that starts that. And oh. you push me out the funnel. That's gonna do that. We want the other cube to angle that up to here. That'll go like that, and that'll allow us to get to the exit, I assume. It is only an assumption. Okay, so. Let's start moving things like this. This kind of reminds me of a bit of the, um... The Fizzler Frenzy map. Do you remember that one, guys? Do you remember Fizzler Frenzy? Ah, uh, let's imagine I didn't put that up there. I'll take this back. Checking it back to the old school. Okay. So that brings it up here. Now I think I could... If I take that up there with me. I can then bring it over here, drop it into here. And we can get it over to here at least. Yeah, we're going to want to take that up there, then we can angle that to there, and that will disable this one. <clears throat> so let's try that first. Just going to want to go somewhere... Oh, I don't know, right about... There. Oh, you turd burglar. a bit of cube logistics here. Is open door policy on the exit? Good to know. 
Alright, so then, what we're going to do, just so we don't do that, let's see what this button's for now. It's to allow us to do all this a little bit easier. We can do this. Press that button again, just to save myself from walking over there. I'm going to want that one back now, I believe. Maybe. So let's put this one here. And we'll go to, say, here. Ultimately, we want all three cubes in here, right? Could I have not done that before already? Oh, but we need that for the exit. But we need the portals first before we can do that. So, I think I may have taken the wrong cube. But hey, we'll just carry on for now. Then what I would do is this. That one is then done by that, so... So I need to leave one cube, like, up there. Alright. I have to say, if this is an indication of how like, the puzzle is going to be... Whew. This could be an intense, difficult puzzle. You see, that's all well and good. I just need to work out which ones we need. So then we need laser here. But this laser that's going to point to here also needs to... I think what I need to do not that I think what I need to do something whereby where's that one come out that one comes out in that bottom corner there Alright, I think I need to swap this cube. So, let's just imagine. We did this. We did this. Let's reset this whole thing here. So then, that is going to point over to there. Mm 
I'm gonna bring this cube to here. And that one's gonna come through here. Oh, that one doesn't turn off. No, it does. What am I doing? What am I talking about? It does. Let's go take it round. That's what I need to do. Take it round here. Like so. Okay, then we're going to do that. Plop a portal there. Then we can do that. Issue being now... See, the problem is, I don't... There isn't a way... There isn't a way to get another cube up top straight away, is there? Also, I've just realised another problem here. Square is needed for the exit to turn that off. Oh no, it's not. Why is, why is that even there then? I don't see the purpose of this one. If I can just want to got that there, I just float all the way up to the top. But hey, maybe that will come apparent uh, soon. Yeah, let's get rid of that. That one goes back over to here. I don't think. Maybe wrong though. Drop down here. that panel up a minute. Reposition this to here, say. Open it up again. Oh, I could have, I could get a cube into here. Yeah, okay, so. Do that. I could get one of these cubes into here, which may or may not help. I swear down, the whole Windows 10 glitchy thing has got worse in recent weeks. Right, let's see how close we are with that. Bang on. Huzzah, I like that. Makes a change. Alright, so I'm going to have that there. Now we're going to want to do... That's what I was afraid of. Oh, balls. Now I saved over the top. Oh well. Okay, sarah, sarah.
But yeah, I do need to take this one. Didn't take that one where? What if this one's still at the top? Uh... Excuse me? I don't believe the test is re <laughs> complete. Don't know why that came up. Buggy game. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Okay, I'm starting to see things in a bit of a better light now. Possibly. That's what that's for. I think that's to stop us from, from putting that there at a certain point until we got that cube over to there. So. Tip this. So now we can get this one into here. The idea now, I think, would be to do something like this. Now we take this one. This one will go over here. That's why we use save spots. That's why we save. Okay. Oh, you twit. Move to keep first knock. Glass. So maybe it needs to be over here, but we need to keep that on there, so that wouldn't make sense. Okay. Keep that. Come on, knock. Think about it.
This is the like the one thing I really hate doing in Portal. Moving cube positions like this. That's why. That is why. But that's also why we quick save, like I keep saying. I don't actually know what I'm going to do when I actually get all the cubes down to this area, if I'm completely honest. I need to send a bit further back from the cube. Too close to the cube. <clears throat> so as I grab it, I'm creating a gap. There we go. So now I'm thinking... We reposition this cube. Something like that. Okay. So now I just need to go back. I think maybe I need to like position that a little bit further back that way. Maybe. that can maybe cause this to respawn. It's, uh... Something like that. Mr. Cube. Right, let's imagine we had this position properly. It's like there. Okay. F6. So. Clear pause a minute. Input output, LB says. So now, I'm going to do this, 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 this. Oh, I need the cube in here. Alright. I would need both the cubes in here in order to get back. How can I tilt, rotate this cube? Do this, I guess. Run over here. Blah, 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 blah. Put this cube in position here. Thank you. 
Then I would come back down here, through here, the portal there. Okay. This is a thing we now have. So then, I think this is what we're going to do. Take this one. Put that one there. This is the one that doesn't turn off, so... happened there. It's all well and good. Oh, what if I had it in a position like that? I could get through here, then remove that. Okay. That's a thing that could be done. So I would need to come back. Totally adjust the angle here, though, of this one. I'm just thinking about that. Does this count as like moving the cube and aiming it at the catcher? I don't know. I don't know. Because then what I would do is that, which gets me back into here. Okay. I definitely need all three cubes in here though.
Problem is, though, I don't have any way to go that side without fizzing my paw. And that's problematic. Nothing that turns that portal off. Completely and utterly screwed me. Target. That's a fizzler. I don't know at this point. I'm just, it's getting very hard to tell. That would have fizzled my portal anyway to do this. Doesn't matter about this anymore. Hold on. Doesn't matter about this anymore. Alright, hold on. Let's go back and do this again, because then it wouldn't matter about moving, losing that bit once we've... Yeah, okay, okay, okay. So, how will I do there? Let's go about the portal for now. Right, so, jump up here. Do this, do this. La la la. Then we're going to say this. I'm going to go up to here. Okay, then we're going to do that. So, now we have this. Pull there now. Okay. And now we do that. Oh, let's just imagine I didn't walk into there, please. Ha! Ah. Okay. So then with the other cube. Let's save. <clears throat> With the other cube, still not sure how we get this cube back, though. I'll be completely honest.
Unless there's something slightly different that happens for some reason. Okay. How am I meant to get that cube back? Because the only way to get back up to the top I think I know what I did wrong. I think I've got to start the whole thing all over again. I think the blue cube needs to be the red cube. <sighs> okay. So, let's start this all over again. Oh shit. That one goes there. This one. We'll just go there. Okay. Comes into here. That one goes into there. Take this one up and over. Okay, so we need to guard the red cube with our life. Hold on, though. That won't work, will it? Because I need this to be turned off to take it through into there. I don't think this is right. to here.
Let's just do anything. No. I'm stuck because the only way to open this is a cube on top. The only cube we can get on the top is the red cube. So I don't think that is right. I could have sworn I had a point earlier on in the puzzle. Where I had all three cubes in here. Definitely need all three cubes here, though. That's that's the thing. <sighs> and there is no walkthrough. All right. Well, I'm going to have to have um, a little bit of a thought about this one. So um, I will be back real soon. Alright guys, so I'm back here with Castle of Glass part number two. And we're actually restarting the level here. Um, I've been giving this some thought off camera. Please continue into the and I believe the crucial chamber. part of this is to swap this cube out races. into the bottom and here. Test subjects react when locked in room now I believe the only way I can do that is to actually pass one of the other cubes up through this area here. So, that's what we're actually going to work with and see if we can't kind of get something going here. So, let's get that set up for a start. So, let's get this cube up to the top for a start and in position because we're going to need it to open up this side fizzler uh, here first before we can actually do anything like that so now that we have that in place I will tilt this cube like so Excellent. All right. But first, before we do that, it really matters which one we use. We need to point that to there, so that we can actually get this one into here for a start. Because the plan is, once we've actually got the portal in. There, we can actually res once we've done with this top area, we can actually. I'm guessing it's got to be there, and we'll respawn the cube like that in a way. I guess. Uh, I don't know. I'm just kind of. I've got some ideas in my head. I just need to try them. So, first of all, then we need to get this cube out of here. So what I'm actually going to do? Let's throw that one up there. I'm going to save there for now. And then what we'll do is we'll go up to the top here. This is where we're actually going to do our swapping out of the cubes. So that one goes there. That one goes there. It's the only way. That is the only way that I can see to swap that red cube down to the bottom. Because this side fizzler there never turns off during the, for the duration of the map. So if that's not how I get the red cube down, then I genuinely don't know. Okay. 
So, next up. What is our next plan of action? Our next plan of action is to move the cube into that area there, I guess. So we're going to want to put this like that direction. And then this one will point to the top here. Like so. Actually, no. Let's point it here first. Then we'll tilt this one. Like so. Okay, I'm going to go back to the top. And we'll reposition this one over here. Like so. Okay. Now we have that. actually place our portal there. So now it's a case that we need to start to work backwards. Okay, that one's been fizzled, which is what I wanted. Six. Now I really want to block this laser again so I can pick this one up. Okay. Now, what I want to do here is that, that, now I can move this one, and I should be able to point this one, it doesn't really matter where I point that one actually. Okay. Leave that one there. Now with this cube, I'm going to want to point this one to here. That gives us this cube back. Wow, what I did before was so long and convoluted. It was unreal. Right, so then that one goes to there. And now I should be able to and boom we should be done I don't see another way to get the red cube down so if that's not how I get the red cube down I'm not sure how to solve it but quite quite a good map um, it's Congratulations. Not a massive fan of maze puzzles normally, but that one actually did require a bit of logical thinking about how to get that cube down and which um, receivers to hit at the right time. So um, for that, I will give you a thumbs up, Saringer. Thank you very much for watching, guys. 
As always, please like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any maps you'd like to play, please leave them in the comments or head over to my Google form. A link to that is in the description. But until next time, I've been Nock, you've been awesome. Happy gaming.